Hello and welcome to another special video review and today we've got the Chinese character animal combiner. <laughs> so this is a little bit of a educational uh, transforming characters from China. So you can learn Chinese and have fun with transformers and you know it's all being edu educational so <laughs> so obviously this comes from seriestoys.com i'm gonna put the link in the description below and uh, yeah like i said these are actually pretty cool the plastic quality is really nice very solid it's much better than the original uh, well the uh, the normal the normal uh knockoff toy cheaply made these are actually actually has like a quality in them so yeah, well, they uh, they are uh, actual character names uh, for uh, animals in China. Uh, yeah, Chinese character for animals. So for example, uh, we have a dog right here. We have the cards that comes with it. So we have a dog right here. Dog in China is Go. I'm not sure about the pronunciation. And then you have the character for dog. And if you can see here, the card is blue, so blue also. And the character is also represented in here. So that's the same character with as this, and this transform into a dog. So yeah, we have cattle right here, new, and you have the character right here, and the character right here is the same, and it transform into a cattle. So I, I thought it was really cool. So we have a tiger, a sheep. We don't have the monkey. We don't have the horse. Like there's a couple of characters. We do have the dragon. We do have the rabbit. Don't have the chicken, don't have the mouse. So maybe there were two sets of those and I got only one set. So I have this set right here and we still have this set or maybe because these are like two characters, like uh, Lao Shu for mouse and it's two characters, we only, only have one. Uh, Gong Ji could have had like pig because it's Zhu. But then the Cobra, <laughs> Zhang Yi She. Ma for a horse and Hosey for a monkey. So yeah, a couple of characters, so hmm. So like I said, we do have characters right here. On the other side we have uh, the uh, transformation and we also have the combiners. So for those that we have, uh, we have, we actually have like the depiction of the character and the robot or the transform animal. But for those that we don't have, we'll show the uh, combiner because they do combine because why not <laughs> and it's an abomination of character but uh, yeah it, it does combine so yeah maybe there are not two sets like maybe it's just one set and you know those are just there to keep uh, to be more educational by learning a couple of more animals like the advanced ones <laughs> so yeah rabbit let's start with rabbit right here uh, like I said this is a 2z and uh, it probably means rabbit, and uh, it transforms into a rabbit. So, yeah, uh, transformation, uh, really simple. First you flip this open, bring the ears out, flip the head all the way around, like this. Take uh, this part right here, this is gonna be the tail out. Flip these open, these, oops, and these are on clips so they can clip off. Let's bring this back up in. All right, this one also clipped off. <laughs> All right, like this, and bring the legs out. Legs out. I guess they go like this, maybe. So we have a rabbit. <laughs> it does have a little bit of articulation here. The head does rotate. Do move up like this, like this. Uh, the legs are pretty stable, doesn't move a lot. These does have a hinge, but yeah, not a lot. And the tail does wiggle up and down. So we have the rabbit right here. And let's put the rabbit cart. <laughs> Next up we have a long dragon. So uh, dragon, again, we have this right here. Uh, dragon is very simple to transform. Uh, you bring the head on the other side like this, bring it down. Flip this like this, bring the head down. So you have like this, you have the mouth right here, you can open it up. And then you have uh, the tail right here that you flip down. So yeah, oh, we have the legs, or I guess. And that's as far as it goes, yeah. 
So that's pretty much it. Uh, not much to it. And if you can look right here, that's uh, that's pretty much it. Except for the head, they placed it like this. Mm. But yeah, it can move. So yeah, dragon. Like I said, the like I showed, the mouth does open and close. Head can rotate, move up like this. Not much at the legs here or the tail here. So very very basic dragon mode. Put the card right here. Next up, we have Young a sheep. <laughs> that character right here. So this transforms into a sheep. Uh, the legs can go in like this. This opens up, this opens up. This goes down, this goes down, like this. So we have the head, the ears, and these splits apart. Make it a thicker, rounder, kind of round, <laughs> rounder stomach. And we have the tail. So now we have the sheep. So, uh, not much articulation at all beside the tail and the head. You have a couple of just a couple of eyes on each side and pretty much it. Sheep with the cart next to it. <laughs> just for the fun of it. Alright, next up we have oh, Tiger. Lao Hu. Lao Hu. Yeah, I have no idea about my pronunciation, so um, yeah, bear with me. So on the other side we can see the letter right here of the character means tiger or Lao Hu. And uh yeah, transformation. Oop. Uh, transformation. We pull this out like this. Bring the legs on the side like this. Bring the back. You need to pull it. Oops, lost the leg. Pull it like this. Slide it out. And then you rotate the torso like this. And then you bring the tail out. So let's plug the leg back in. Voila. So we have the tiger, and actually looks like a nice tiger. I mean, the head kind of looks scared more than the than being the tiger, but yeah, it works. The head can move down, uh, legs not much, it's like rotating like this. Uh, the waist can rotate a little bit. The tail can move up and down, uh, ab crunch, I guess. But uh, that's pretty much it for Taga. Taga. And next up we have Cattle Neil, and yeah. That little character right here. Uh, cattle, uh, flip the horns out, bring the legs like this, like this, and then flip the uh, legs like this. Bring this in the back, flip the legs, flip the legs, split it open, and bring the tail out, tiny tail. <laughs> I don't, I'm not sure about the tail though. Looks more like a wee wee than a uh, something else. I mean, <laughs> yeah, okay. So we have the cattle. <laughs> Let's put it here. The card. And finally, we have Go. Dog. And my pronunciation is gonna. People are probably gonna complain right now in the, uh, <laughs> in the comments that that's not how I pronounce it. I don't know. I never learned Chinese, Mandarin, or whatever. So yeah, dog, uh, this one uh, you need to flip the head out like this, bring the, le the head down like this, bring the legs out in the back like this, and you have the tail. And that's pretty much it. So we have a dog. <laughs> this one's actually pretty cute. So yeah, the head can move up and down, do have articulation of the front legs back legs and the tail so this one's actually more articulated so yeah and here the cart <laughs> and obviously like I said uh, the uh, they do combine and oof, they do they combine well if just first uh, of all just let's see comparison with a uh, cyberverse figure I got cyberverse RC right here see uh, uh, comparison and if you just want to compare with the vehicle mode, ugh, I've got Earthrise Toys right here. So, mm, gives you an idea of how big they are. So, they, they are a little bit smaller in the luxes, depending, because the cattle is actually bigger. But, yeah, whatever. It's deluxe ish, big legend size, I guess. <laughs> 
So, yeah, let's remove those. Alright, so they do combine, and uh, oof, combination is uh, an awe inspiring thing. So, for transformation, uh, actually, the dragon doesn't do much besides just closing this, closing this. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, this will act as the elbow spinning arm. This is actually the most articulated uh, thing there is in the, uh, the whole combiner. You can flip this peg out. Uh, if I can, I'm gonna need a tool. Alright, flip this peg out. This is gonna be the uh, left arm. Right there. This is gonna be the waist, uh, the sheep. So the waist, I need to close this in, close this in. Flip these, uh, close the, 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 the tail. You need to close the head and flip it up. Uh, close these, close these, alright, like this, like this, like this, alright. So the head needs to go up, this needs to go down. You need to clear uh, especially that hole right here. So again with my tool, let's flip these open because they are pretty deep. So they are loose, but they are really deep, so there's no there's no way to get them out really. This is gonna be the waist. So sheep. Dog right now. Uh, the dog makes the leg and the, the dog is you just put him back into uh, the letter mode. So just put it completely into a letter. Like this. That's it. And yeah, I'll go like this, I think. Yeah. This is one leg. Uh, where's the other leg? Uh, the, the rabbit is the other leg. So let's start with the legs. So close this. Again, just put it completely in letter mode. So it goes like this, goes like this. Clip, clip. Clip this, clip this. Clip this, clip this. So it's back into a letter mode. And now using that peg, uh, this will make the, the connector right here. So we'll plug it in. Voila, one leg, and the other one right here, this peg hole. All right, we got the legs right now. <laughs> Next up, the tiger is gonna be an arm. Uh, again, not much to do with it. Uh, just pull, flip this around, close the legs together. Oops. These just keep pegging off. Bring the legs, the the, the head down if you want. I I rather. Uh, the instruction tells you to live, uh, let it, uh, let it go up, but uh, yeah, I'll leave it like this. This is gonna be the uh, right arm, so you can pull this out like this. And finally, we have the cattle. Put these back a little bit. The cattle uh, will make the torso. So uh, this connector needs to go like this. Bring the legs out. Uh, no, they, they don't close the legs. You just close the uh, tiny legs in, tiny legs in, tiny legs in. Flip these all the way around. Flip these all the way around. The waist goes down like this. This pulls back like this. This spreads like this. And you lift up the combiner head right here. There you go. So now you have the complete torso done. So bring, uh, yeah, bring this up. You have the square hole and the square peg right here. Plug it in. There you go. And then you can clap this in like this. Let's move the camera a little bit up. And then finally you just plug these into the arms. One and two. And there you go, we have the uh, Chinese character animals combined. <laughs> <It's> <laughs> why, did it, why, did they <laughs> why did they bother, man? I mean, okay, uh, everything has to combine nowadays, but no, okay. <laughs> I mean, the legs doesn't even look like legs. They, they're just big stumps. At least, at least this one's an elbow <laughs> And rotation. Uh, this is just a hook. 
I mean, we do have the kettle head that makes a nice torso, I guess. And the head, uh, the combiner head does have rotation. So that that's cool, I guess. <laughs> There's no paint, no detail, no anything. At least doesn't have a lot of kibble in the back beside this. <laughs> Well, yeah, everything nowadays needs to combine, so... Ta -da -da. <laughs> but I really like the idea about the uh, learning Chinese. I mean, the, the the whole educational learn Lao Hu, Niu, Long, Tuzi, Go, Yang. I mean, I'm not sure about the pronunciation. I'm just reading as I can. So, yeah, but I really like this. It's a decent... A really good idea for little children to start learning, uh, you know, characters and farm animals. So it's a good start. Uh, just wish we had more for uh, the other ones and make an even bigger <laughs> combiner, I guess. That would have been fun. But, yeah, like I said, I picked that up at SherryToys.com. I'm going to put the link in the description below. Go and pick them up. They're really cool. They're very nice for children, especially if they want to learn. Or if you're in the... Uh, Trying to learn Chinese, you know, Mandarin, or I'm not sure, man. But yeah, if you want to learn, it's a good start. I mean, now I know that uh, Go is dog. <laughs> go, Go. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't know what the under the reverse hat thing on the the whole means. So yeah, <laughs> Go, dog. Yeah, I'm uh, speaking Chinese. All right, so that's pretty much it for me. Like, subscribe, leave a comment. I'm going to have tons more stuff coming up real soon, so you don't want to miss anything. So I thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.